are Northwestern's, Northwestern's Alka Rocket team. Go Cats! I decided to join the Alka Rocket Challenge mostly because I love rockets. It's a great opportunity to learn more about a different kind of rocketry where you're dealing with an entirely different substance as opposed to the more solid rocket propellant that we typically use. As a group, the challenge that we tackled first was just what is this rocket going to look like? Our rocket is really two main pieces, the launch system and then the rocket itself. Our rocket doesn't have an internal propulsion chamber. Instead, it has an external propulsion chamber, which basically acts as a cannon. Within the rocket, there is an electrical system that releases the parachute. We 3D printed it out of ABS. The ball valves were made out of steel. The reaction chambers was made out of polycarbonate. The water chamber and everything else, we made it steel. One of the big challenges we had was trying to estimate how much pressure we'd actually end up developing. In our initial trial of the rocket, we found out that we'd underestimated a lot of things and we had a bunch of pressure leaks, so it didn't actually fly. That's the fun thing about rocketry. The things you plan never really happen the way you plan it to, and there's a lot of problem solving on the fly. Even though we hadn't had a very successful launch, we were still very confident because of how unique our design was. I was actually in class when I found out, and I jumped up and down and I said, we got in, we're finalists. I was just filled with emotions. I just was completely overcome and just started jumping up and down in my apartment. The first call I made was to my mother because she had been following this competition a lot and my progress through it and I thought she should be the first one to know. It's definitely a sense of legitimacy, you know, being able to go to, you know, the top dog in terms of aerospace engineering and, you know, show them what we got. And it'll be fun just the four of us to do some problem solving on the launch site and see the rocket that we've put so many hours into actually work. I'm just blown away that I even have the chance to be in the Guinness Book of World Records. Just the prestige of knowing that my team was the best in the world at something is really cool. It just reaffirms that, you know, if you just follow whatever it seems cool to you, whatever your passions are, cool things can happen. It's just an incredible experience and it's even better with friends.